Hello everyone, this is Cheryl once again from Salad Master here in Perth and today I want to show you how to cook a chicken biryani the traditional way. The only difference is we will not be putting any oil. First thing that we need to do is to marinate the chicken, one kilo that I cut into big pieces with yogurt, only half of what is in the recipe. Half of the chili that we put in the recipe, half of the garlic and ginger paste. Now, time to add the spices. Two teaspoons of chili powder and one teaspoon of cumin seeds. Mix it and marinate it for one hour. For the meantime, wash your rice properly and soak it in water for about 20 minutes, then drain. We have to preheat the cookware. We are using our 5 quart wok. We will put it on medium and for the meantime, I'll be cutting. And this is the lid of the wok, which is I can use as a container if you have the old model. Using pole number 4, 2 large onions or 4 medium sized onions. Now let's see if our my pork wok is ready. Water is dancing. It's happy. The next thing that we need to do is to put the onion. No oil. So once the onion is brown, transfer it in a plate. On the same cookware, put spices letter A which is cinnamon, cardamom, bay leaf, cloves, and crushed black peppercorns. Put it on medium heat. Now it's time to add our chicken that we marinated a while ago. Cook it until the chicken gets brown. After five to 10 minutes, put tomatoes, Half of the instruction for the fresh coriander, half of the fresh mint, half of the onion that we already cooked, and the rest of the yogurt. Cover for about 15 minutes until the chicken is a little bit tender. Now, in a 7 quart roaster, put water and let's add the rice that we washed and bring it to a quick boil. Put some salt to taste. Simmer for one minute, then remove the water and clean up the seven quart roaster. On our seven quart roaster, let's put half of this rice. Let's put the cooked chicken on the top. Let's put the remaining rice. Add about two pinches of saffron with a half cup of water and I'll spread it on the top. Cover and cook on low heat until the rice is fluffy and the mixture is dried. Mix it. And it's time to garnish it with the rest of the ingredients. Half of the coriander, mint, half of the chili that we prepared, the rest of the fried onion, lemon wedges. And this is our chicken biryani cooked the traditional way without a drop of oil. Alternatively, you can buy a ready-made chicken biryani mix. I really like this brand, Chan. And all you need to do is to cook your rice, wash it, put water, and before you put it on heat, just mix this powder in the rice. And you can add some vegetables like tomatoes and uh, curry leaves, chicken, or other things that you want to put in your biryani, and that's it. Put all in, cook for about 25 to 30 minutes, depending how many your rice is. Thanks for watching! Now, if you like this video, don't forget to please hit like and subscribe on our YouTube channel. Bye!